Welcome to CAD Institution. This is our lecture number six, in which we are going to solve an integration by using MATLAB. Here we have the MATLAB uh, 2017B. So let's start. We have the question, question number thirteen of the book, and here is our relation: uh, integral of x square cos x dx is equal to. That's a formula of x square cos x dx. That's equals to two x cos x plus x square minus two into sine x. And uh, calculate use MATLAB to calculate the following definite integral. The limit is pi by three to pi by six and x square cos x dx. So let's just start. Uh, first of all, uh, when you are going to use integration, first we have to mention int is equals to and at the right. Okay, wait a minute. Space at x bracket x. Uh, because the limit is in x, uh, the x uh, is the variable. So x space again bracket x dot square. That shows x square. The here is x square. Now next is cos x. For this again uh, dot multiply by cos x bracket close. And this is the uh, question that is x square dot multiply cos x, and we use at x because uh, at the right x shows the x is the variable. Uh, now, enter. Now we are going to use the syntax for integration. We have the syntax i n t e g r a l integral bracket. Now it is asking function x mean x max that mean minimum and maximum limits and the function function we have defined as int so put int comma next is uh, the limit uh, pi by 6 is the lower limit so pi pi by 6 comma pi by 3 bracket close for the integral uh, now you can again check integral is equals to add x square cos x and integral the syntax is the uh, bracket int that shows this function uh, or the, the uh, this variable comma for the limit the lower limit is pi by 6 and the upper is pi by 3 and is equals to that so shows the answer 0 0.2208 that's the answer of this integral so this is how you can solve any integral not this one you can solve any of the integral that uh, by using the MATLAB and it will give you the answer in a second uh, and uh, unfortunately we have uh, no any example of the integral so this is going to be and here this lecture hope you will try by yourself uh, some more questions and if you face any problem in any of the question then you can ask me in comment section i will try to solve it for you and in the last don't forget to subscribe to station and share to your friends thank you